Hey what's up guys welcome to another video in which we are going to write python program to find the factors of a number so guys basically factors of a number are the numbers that perfectly divides that number and the remainder is zero so we can use the for loop to find the factors of entered number so guys let us check this with the help of example now in the vs code we are going to write the python program so the very first thing that we will be doing is we will take the input from the user which will be the number so over here we use the input function and then we say enter number to find factors so user will be entering the number to find the factors and now guys this number it will be of the string data type we need to convert it into the integer so we need to have the prefix that is the int function inside which the entire input function will be enclosed so basically this string data type will be converted to the integer data type and it will be assigned to the number variable now guys simply we can use the for loop in order to find all the factors for this number so we say for and then we have the variable that is i in and then we use the range function and this range will go from 1 up to the number that is entered by the user plus 1 since we need to include this number as well we need to have plus 1 over here so that we have the extra number which is excluded from this range so guys let's say when we provide the number 10 we need to go from 1 up to 10 so the second parameter should be 11 over here in this case which is excluded during the program execution now guys after this we have a colon and then what we can do is simply we can have the condition that is when this number percent i is it equal to equal to 0 so when we say number percent i is it equal to 0 so when we divide this number by the number i if the remainder is 0 that means i is one of the factors of that number so basically we simply have to provide the print statement and then we will say i over here which is one of the factors and then guys before this for loop what we can do is we can simply have the label that is factors of number and then we will print the number and then r followed by colon and then after this we can have the format followed by the number that is entered by the user which will be replacing these curly braces over here so guys let me just save this file now and try running this code so as we can see enter number to find factors is being asked to the user so let's say we provide the number 10 so when we press enter as you can see these are the factors that is number 1 then we have 2 and then 5 and then 10 so guys basically this number 1 multiplied by 10 we get 10 and then 2 multiplied by 5 give us 10 then 5 multiplied by 2 gives us 10 and then 10 multiplied by 1 again gives us 10 so guys these are the numbers which are the factors which when multiplied by another integer gives us this result which is the number itself and if we see it in the other way when this number that is entered by the user that is 10 divided by these numbers that is 1 2 5 and 10 we always get the remainder as 0 and that is why these are the factors of this number that is entered by the user now guys let me just run this code once again let us see what are the factors of the number 20 over here so when we press enter these are the factors that is 1 2 4 5 10 and then 20 so guys all these numbers when multiplied by another integer it gives us this number that is entered by the user which is 20 over here guys what if we provide a number which is a prime number so always remember that the prime numbers are the numbers for which the factors are one or the number itself so basically we do not have any other factors for the prime numbers apart from the number itself and one so let's say we run this code once again over here and when we provide the prime number that is 11 over here so the factors will be 1 and 11 only because there is no other number which will be multiplied by any other number in order to find this number that is entered which is 11 so when we press enter it is 1 and then 11 only let's say when you run this code once again and when you provide the number that is 13 over here what will be the factors of 13 comment in the comment section below let us see whether your answer is correct or not so guys please make sure that you practice on your own so that you get to know what are the factors of 13 and you can successfully comment the correct answer in the comment section below make sure that you like this video so that it reaches to more people and subscribe to the channel so that you get the notifications on upcoming videos as well the next video that we are going to talk about is python program to make a simple calculator so stay tuned